So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use grid method without measuring. Yeah, you heard it right, without measuring. So at the first, let me tell you something. All the artist who uses pen to draw why you need this piece of paper. Cause it helps to not smell your ink while drawing, and it helps to clean your nibs when the ink flows more. So your pen's artwork looks more clean like mine and other professional artists. So I me tell you how I use the grid method by using this scribble. By using this type of grid method, you don't have to measure and don't need to waste a lot of time. Most of the time, I use grid method to make the right position like where I wanted to put the reference and how much I want in the paper. Like when I draw, I don't want to leave the blank spots and make in the middle so it looks perfect while seeing. Like this. Like in this drawing, I don't leave the blank spots. That's why this also looks cool while seeing. Some of the artwork which is not finished yet by seeing this artworks, all the people also ask me why this helps you to make the artworks. So let's start the video. At the first, let's find the reference to draw. I'm using pinsters to find the reference. Let's make this one. So at the first, make the random scribble like you see in the video. Don't leave the blank spots cause you have to make every detail. Just make same as you've seen in the video. Now next step is to take a photo of that scribble paper. While taking the picture, make sure to click the perfect. You have to notice the border of the paper cause you have to take the straight. Then open the snapseed you can find that in the Play Store. This is not necessary to use, I'm using it to make the paper more visible by decreasing saturation and increasing the brightness. It made the white part more whiter and black part blacker. You can follow the steps. And now open the Pixar, this is also available in Play Store. Select the paper you clicked, and you can find the add photo option in the below, click it. Select an add. You can adjust the photo how much you want, adjust it. And lower the opacity, you can also do that in other apps also do the same. Lower it until you see the reference and the pencil marks also as you want. And save it to the gallery and you're good to go. Make it like 50-50 both visible as you can see. Now found the same pencil marks and you can make same as reference. Let me show you making a quick art. because I don't want to make all. I'm just showing you how it turned out. It's not that much good cause I make it quick for video, but you can make better than this. Hope you'll understand. 